Good morning and welcome to BU. My name is Benjamin Juarez. I'm the Dean of the College of Fine Arts and both a Puccini and Toscanini fan since age three. That's almost 57 years ago. On behalf of the Howard Gottlieb Archival Research Center and the College of uh, Fine Arts School of Music, we are really excited to welcome you to this uh, symposium honoring the centenary of the world premiere of La Fanchula del West. This opera is particularly special because it brings together many issues, the New World, the Wild West, meetings of Puccini and David Velasco with Buffalo Bill, with the heroic, the frontier world, with issues of uh, giving the lead active role to a woman in times when that was not common. But I'm sure that this and many other uh, subjects will come about in the symposium today. And I would like to finish my brief introduction welcoming the distinguished panelists and participants, Caroline Gusky, David Rosson, John Conklin, and a very special welcome to Walfredo Toscanini, to Cheryl Green, who is the uh, granddaughter of David Velasco, who are here with us. Unfortunately, Simone Puccini couldn't come today, and also to Harvey Sachs. But first and foremost, I want to congratulate our uh, distinguished faculty member, Deborah Borton, who has really worked uh, doing research in Puccini for many years, and whose books are now uh, a new fantastic web page uh, devoted to Fanchula del West, are really on the edge of not only producing research about the operas of Puccini, but also of communicating this research for the enlightenment and enjoyment of this fantastic composer, composer of his time and composer who's still young, challenging, and relevant a hundred years later, and I'm sure many, many centuries more. <laughs> 